everybody. Welcome to Buffet Minded Kitchen Review. Today we're reviewing the new Barn Organics Barista Almond Milk. It's dairy-free and regenerative. I wonder what that means. USDA organic, non-GMO. Oh, it's 120 calories for only uh, for eight ounces. It's got seven grams of fat, 11 grams of added sugar. Uh-oh, that's going to be sweet. Almond milk. Shake well. I'm going to make sure to shake well. Love is food. And I would say food is love. Uh, our barista almond milk delivers a truly exceptional, oh, truly, haha, <laughs> inside joke, a truly exceptional dairy free experience. It's a creamer, steamer, and shake maker all in one. Pour it straight into your morning coffee. It won't separate. Or steam it for luscious microphone. It's also refreshing straight from the glass. Good to know. We source our dry farmed almonds from a network of small independent farms that are progressive, organic, and regenerative. Oh, they're using regenerative farming methods. Okay. Our almonds come from trees that are watered mainly with rainfall. I like it. Irrigated only after planting to ensure the roots grow strong. The result is almonds that are full of flavor that you can taste with each delicious sip. So the reason it's sort of blurry is because I'm using my new Zenvo uh, wide angle lens. So it's like making things easier to see, but then it's kind of blurry. So pluses and minuses. Um, but I like how bright it is with this little light that goes with it. Anyway, back to the review. Let's shake it up really well. This and Let's see how it pours. Let's see what it looks like when it pours in. Oh, it's a nice white. I love it. I love when it looks like milk. I don't like milk, but I liked the looks of it. You know, years of pouring cereal as a kid. And then using half and half to get to college. Well, of course, in the coffee, not straight. Okay, I'm going to foam it up and I'll bring it up. Okay, I'm, I'm so excited by this foam. Look at this foaming action. It's incredible. It looks amazing. I'm so excited. I hope it tastes good. Hey, I'm also using my new microphone, so let me know if it sounds better. I have a feeling it will. Okay, back to the back to the I week. am just amazed by the foam. Look at how beautiful. That's just a piece of coffee. Grounds. Look at that. Okay. Let's pour it in and see how it looks as it pours in. Oh my gosh, look at that. Look at, oh gosh, that's beautiful. Okay, that is less foam though than usual. Look, it's quite lower. But look at the beautifulness of it. But as Jacob would say, everybody, Mom, it's Chase that matters. So let's see how it tastes. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, I think the thing is, I'm not that much of a fan of oat milk. It has this weird, like, aftertaste. It's, it's strange. I think that still my favorites are the Costco soy milk. And, of course, my very, very, very favorite is the Oatly oat milk barista version. Um, but if you want to impress people with beauty, this is the most beautiful foam I've ever seen. Look at the... It's like two-tone. <clears throat> You've got the coffee-looking foam and the cloudy, lovely foam. Okay, so if you're somebody who likes taking pictures of foam, this is the one to use, the New Barn Barista Almond Milk. But for taste, I, I would stick with the soy milk or the oat milk. Okay, tell me what you think in comments. Have you tried this? Do you prefer almond milk? Is there an almond milk that's to die for that even somebody like me would like? And then, hey... Melly, what do you think of it all? He, he doesn't think much. He loves the smell of coffee, though. As soon as I start making coffee in the morning, he goes nuts, mainly because he knows I'm going to eat. Okay, everybody, I hope you have a great day. Oh, for a grade, I would give it a C, probably. I think it cost about $5. Um, I would not buy it again. But I do love the packaging. I mean, how cute is that? And uh, I think, you know, the thing is, Taste is what matters. Okay, hope you have a great day and that it involves coffee and bag salads. Bye, y'all.